I'm a pro, I'm a prophet. Mr. Bingwa Africa. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today being on Friday, you know when it's Friday we do things raw and candid and today guys I want to tell you my story. So I told my co-host here before I introduce him, before we share, we let you come and tell us your stories, you first need to know our story. So to share one beer story to how we met, the babies, the saga and everything. So now we are doing our story. Who is Jemtai? Where was she born? Where did she go to school? To our trust the story too before you come and trust us with your story. So guys, today we are doing my story, so come. One plus one, you wanna do. But don't take it slow. Guys, this is Roy and Candy and as usual, yeah? we share stories that change lives and enjoy we enjoy time together as a, as a family. So this is what we do. I know today we are sharing Jimutai stories. And and I know kuna vitu mingi na leo tuziongele. She had four beers for days. Everything I could have four beer ya Kobe, ya Nyoka, Heights, ya Ndege, I could have. Hizo zote tutazieka hapa. And then we we'll, and no after her story, my story will come. And then your stories are welcome and we're going to share the more stories that we share the better. See you. So let's go raw and candy. See you every Friday. Now, who is Jemtai? Alizaliwa wapi? Alizaliwa wapi? Alisomea wapi? Who is this girl from Keio? And today, we get to know about my story. So, the other thing is you will not give me your story. I love you. You know who I could give you. Yes. So from from there, where where you at least people people should know you. Yeah, because we we only see you on TV. On social media but yeah. nobody gets to know exactly who you are so tell me something. so my tell real us. name yes. is stella jemotai koiti uh -huh. that koiti is from my mom's side it's okay. my mom's my mom's surname uh -huh. because my mom was a single mom yeah yes so uh, the koiti is the the, the father the, the, the Muka. Muka now. yes yeah. uh -huh. mm -hmm. so from keio yes yeah you need to tell them well uh, my yenda keio gonna place in it was sandwich yeah, so before we get up, it's a area. It's such a beautiful place. Eh? So tell us about growing up. You, you, you were born in the 90s. Yeah. yeah, I was born in 91, 30 yeah. years ago, guys. I'm 30 hey, years nice. old. <laughs> yeah. So I was born 30 years ago yeah. in a small village called Kapkonga. Oh, yes. In uh, El Geo Marakwet. Yeah. Place. In a, kuna kamoso, just between Kips House and Kamoso, there is a place. Oh, uh, Kamoso is called Metke. So, just before Metke. Come in the shoe, Metke. Kuna Metke girl. Yeah, so yeah. your place is changing now. No, in nature we have only met Kei Kamosor. So I think Metke yeah. the official Gina. Yeah. Kamosor. You are the Akuza. Yeah. So in between Kamosor, maybe Kamosor and Kips House, there is a small, small center in nature Kapunga. That's where I grew up. I was yeah. born yeah. in Kapunga. Yeah. In fact, the, the most amazing story uh, that, that we need to, to know today mm -hmm. is uh, growing up, eh? you, you lived with your grannies. Yeah. Uh, huka, okay, huka first and foremost, I, res I respected my mom's decision, yeah. Mm -hmm. But when I was in Nairobi, I was in Nairobi, maybe I was in Nairobi, I was in Nairobi, I was in Nairobi, I was in a single mom in Nairobi, I was in Nairobi, I was in Nairobi, I was in I made a decision to go to Nairobi, I was in Nairobi, I was in environment kwa unajua yeah. eh, so i was raised by guka yangu na shosha yangu uh -huh. yeah. that's why you are keyo is thinking yeah eh keyo yake ni imeiba i can speak fluent keyo anaweza kuandikia dictionary <laughs> <laughs> translation yes ukimpata okay, nairobi amepotea sio bure keyo unajua maana ilianza so and your your grand your grandpa had uh, you had two shoshas shoshas yeah. at the same time mm -hmm. uh, one or two grannies yeah so your, your grandpa was like me I'm, I'm like your grandpa. So my grandfather, Alikona, <laughs> my mom, and I talk about her side, your first wife. Uh -huh. Alikona, my, my, my. <laughs> Okay, I live mean you live like it at Cheupen. Cheupen was the second wife, Chelsea was the first wife. Uh -huh. yes. Not, uh, just as the name suggests, the new query, Cheupen, Nimope, Chelsea, Nimose. How about your color in Matogia? Yeah. So uh, tell us about uh, growing up and how I see what a Karibuna. Because you had, you gonna go car, who come more than me, Changamuka, Lafu could also see wing your surround the two socials and other people. Uh, how was it going? Okay, social to Moja look on a ship far, not, not Caribbean as Sisi, but Sisi to look off free, Kushi place on a Unal, Unazenda, Kashashu, which open gives a particle with Lala. It was home for yeah. everyone. So, um, maybe in the Likonashi, I was the 
the mayai of the family. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, hey. alikuwa nanipe. Hey, do you know my nickname Nikio Mdogo's professor? Yes, in fact that's why you found. How fa- did you know? How did you, how did you find <laughs> professor? You've been looking <laughs> for professor. Bukangu alikuwa anasemanga I'm too bright. Alikuwa ananitanga professor. So I grew up in Kito professor mango wangu imeanza kufade sasa hivi. Ilipotelea na kuka. Yeah. Ukachukua na manguka na manko zangu basi hivi anza kufade. Your friend calls me chief. I think you're live like because you found the professor now so, so, yeah you can just think it is a professor even. yes <laughs> so i grew up mm-hmm. I, just kumoja yeah. i nilikuwa kuna camera man wetu you smoke mm-hmm. so every time nilikuwa na nikiwa na karibu na yeye sikuwa naelewa ni nini yeah. kumbe ni memories za nilicollect so, from to yeah. because my guka and shosho walikuwa some very good chain smokers na walikuwa wanapiga bash peke yao eh. wanaketi hapo nje <laughs> you used to tell me walikuwa nakaga hapo nje kila mtu na napigia yake shosho wangu walikuwa na chapanga ilikuwa inatonga scope yeah. i think by the time i was class in class 2 3 nilikuwa na joke light a fake oh yeah you na tumbo na shosho jikoni na ni jikoni ile Unaona unapuliza moto unaiwakisha unaipeleka. So I think nilipotana na wewe mshei wa kamera nilikuwa nanga ni boys yeah. juu ya hiyo side. Siko anajua. Yeah. Kumbe past yako it yes. is always ata, itakufuatanga tu. It is in a subconscious. Yes, yeah. What happens between 0 and 10 years like potayagi? Yeah. It, it changes your life forever. So kama uli grow up ukisikia hapa rufu ukikasikia hata saa hizi una feel. Oh oh oh. Oh 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 yangu. Na ulikuwa nakupenda. Unajua kwanza kama ulikuwa nakupenda Do you know what people are seeing on TV? Yeah. Makozo zangu ananibembeleza nikamungilesha wakishe TV. Nongelesha <laughs> kuka. Eh, yeah, ilikuwa nafungongwa TV, alikuwa nafunga na naked padlock na nini. Allah. Bukangu alikuwa ex ex jeshi. Alikuwa <laughs> 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 naleta military camp huko. Yeah. Eh. Mm-hmm. So akiwafungia hakuna kuna TV. Hakuna. Yeah. So uh from 91 to 99 ilishu shaguni kwa nasomea hapo kwa South Primary. Yeah. 99 unfortunately my guka died. Mhm. Yeah. Tukafanya bari ole, mla kitu wakani tumemba well mm-hmm. But siku moja tu madhangu walikuja kanembea 99, I was 8 mm-hmm. Kanembea sasa, nataka ufuwa hizi manguwa Juhu mtuko nafanyua kila kitu, kuna yeah. ufuwa Kanembea, nataka ujifulei manguwa because next week unenda shule utakua na jifulea So uko 8 eh? I was barely 9 So you are class 2 or class 3? Class 2? No, I was in class 3 class 3 yeah. yeah 99 was in class 3 aha uh-huh. so umeambiwa um, mzee osha nguo anza kupiga tizi you are going to Kwenye a boarding unenda. school ah, yeah yeah no ulijua uliambiwa ni wapi ama ilikuwa unajua unajua i didn't know i used to speak fluent kio yeah au juu kiswahili here i am i'm barely nine <laughs> i'm in boarding school people are talking in kiswahili yeah na niko hapo yeah. that is 2000 january i went to boarding school kuna shule inaitwa elder maravin mission primary ehe uh-huh. Elder M- M- Ravin Misha. Mm. Mm-hmm. So I mean a new culture people are speaking Kiswahili. Yes. What you want you want? Na kitu inaitwa preps. Yes. Where I come from I used to kulala mapema at yeah. six, seven I'm in bed. Shapigo maziwa yako fiti. Hata sikwa mispendi maziwa. Hata ukiwa mdogo. Au kwa kunya maziwa yangu ni vita. Mimi sipendi maziwa. Unless you want me ni dawa. Eh unless I'm going it's a at the end point. Kunya mama. So yeah, yeah, niko boarding school. I'm na I'm I was 8 eh January was 8 July 9 May. Yeah. Hi, niko boarding school. So I used to lala you guy. I yeah. know boarding school. Yeah. Me by 7 nilikuwa nifikanga 7. Ah. Hii mambo ya preps ni ya nani? Alafu nilikuwa ga introvert. Juu nikiongea watu wanacheka. Uh-huh. So, <laughs> Sababu ya accent imezidi. Hata siko hajua Kiswahili. What was that? <laughs> so, okay, <laughs> Kiswahili nilikuwa na John ile tulikuwa tunasomanga shule. Yeah. So, I mean school, I mean class 4. Mhm. Uh-huh. People speaking Kiswahili, ukiongea yeah. wanacheka. Yeah, so, so so I think my whole or the whole of class 4 I didn't speak. I used to be an introvert kabisa. Nilo mji shut down. Eh yeah, na shut yeah. down. So alafu shule kuna mama yako? Hakuna. Hakuna. The dunia so sasa ngine anajipata nililala, watu walienda, wachi ananiamsha. Wanakuacha kwa darasa? Aniacha. Kama unaona tafadhali. Kwa sababu ni watu. If you are watching and you are in that class, so shame on you. That is bad. <laughs> we were kids pia wao. Wanamuka na kwela. Eh we were nine we were kids. Yeah. Some auto usually it was a girl school. Yeah. It was a all girl boarding school. Yeah. Ah so una una mtu na kuacha na kwamba ukimbie na kuangalia aki bless that soul wherever you are. Yeah. Not less. Mm-hmm. Alikuwa anasimama ananiambia kimbia nikaangalia niongee kwa dogo. It's quite a distance. Yeah. 
kama kutoka hapa viewers hawataelewa it's quite a distance ananiangalia na kimbia hadi naingia kwa dog ehe unaingia dog so i think the reason i repeat class 4 juni i repeat class 4 to 1 i repeat na class 4 ni ju the whole of 2000 yeah. i was nilikuwa na culture shock kinda yeah. ya yeah. ku get to know this new culture ya shule yes. boarding swahili mm. people sijai skim to kiongea kikuyu yeah. so umepata watu multi lingo au jini nani eh au jini nani so i think the whole year nilikuwa na culture shock ya yeah. well the dunia ni mpya yeah. na how, how did you cope uh, ukitoka chuo unaenda home what was happening hiyo time Si una tafuta mtu anatoka kama msoro mnaendanisha. Hakia nani? Eh, yeah, you I remember. Yeah. Tukirudi ngi after shoot ufunga shule matatu zilikuwa anga face me. Yeah. Ndio it was kitambo. Eh, yeah, ni kazi ya kitambo yeah. na, na, na bench it was bench. Yes. Uh-huh. 2000 I remember. Yeah. From Ravina di kwetu ilikuwa na 30 bob. I think say it's 200 or 150 don't know. Eh. Uh-huh. Mm. Inflation wati yangu. Mm. Yeah. So at um, um, ulikuwa unatoka chuo unaenda home. Ujipange yeah. hapo kutoka stage ulikuwa unajua na stage nini si una tafuta mtu anatoka side yenu mnaenda unajua aje ni mtu anatoka side yenu si anti watoto mama ikuja visiting anakwambia oh ni mama ya nani ni una vile tu god oh, no. grace by the grace of god una jua nanga yeah. yeah. i says hata kumbuka ina happening aje yeah. mm. so the first time nilijipata kwa matatu solo ilikuwa hiyo type yeah. 2000 and we went home na ukajifikisha mm. shosho alikuwa eh yeah, shosho alikuwa was he shocked kukuona No, she was happy. I'm, I'm home. I'm the plan. So, I could do, I could do, I could do, I could do, No, I think, I, I, I don't know. See, do you story by the way, like Lisa? So, I think I could do, I could do, from there, what was the experience? I don't know. Yeah. I can't remember. So, uh, you can repeat, you can't change the same school? The same school. Oh, uh-huh. Did you move to, because you moved to another school? There is a school that you have to go to. Uko ravine uko. Musere. Yes, Musere. Yes, Ageri, you know. So, as Ageri ulijipata mwaka gani? 204. So, eh. Uh-huh. It was a transition from Hapo nikuja shule yenye brother yangu hapo. Oh, so ah, yes. In mm. fact, so my big brother yeah. was in that school. Uh-huh. So it was, and they were doing so well. Uh-huh. Yes, Ageri was performing quite well. Uh-huh. So I moved from Mission Primary to now where my brother is yes. of course uh-huh. it's a gate uh-huh. you should really unajua character development yeah within <laughs> one month umeshajua kuongea the sign language because uko nasoma na madef ah okay mm, umeshajua kusema jina yako yes uh, a b c d halafu okay a b c d i can't remember <laughs> well, at least you umejua eh yeah. but i remember school moja nikiwa form 2 yeah kuna defa lingenga shule yeah I was all confused ni kana nikamongelesha watu walishtuka Shule ulikuwa ni shule gani Hapa eno Oh sasa umekuja ngongo ya high school Eh so nipigie story ya Isageri Yule mta najua kuna kitu uko na phobia ya nyoka na na najua huko huko ni kubaya That is the home unajua huko kumekauka ni Baringo kaida kwa hiyo place ni Baringo ish ni kurafu Na kwa hiyo unaenda hivi dom mtu anafunga hivi box yake kumbe nyoka iko hivi Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alafu wazingi yake zikitaka pia wanatafuta yeah, maji. Uh, oh, so, oh. <laughs> Watu wamechanuka hiyo area wanaonekana yeah. maji nje. Uyikunywe oh, iende. Iende. Hata yeah. sasa zingine mko class nyoka ndogo inaingia tu kwa class inapita hapo mbele. Na hakuna watu huko wana wana pressure. Eh wewe jam, hakuna hata kuzoea. Uta hizo hela nyoka. Hapana hiyo wewe phobia yako ni mbaya. But kuna watu wanajulikana nga hawa ni makachas. Eh au au ni wale wa mtaa. So hiki tokea ni wewe benja. Ndio roji. Akuja tulie. Eh hiyo shule ilikuwa poa. Nikasoma hadi darasa la nani? Na mama eh mbona? Hapo nikaingenga dance flat dance group flani kuna chungwa Joy Singers. Sikiniana nilikuwa nimekonda kama sijui. Ulikuwa Joy Singers. Dancers. Ma dancers. Si uchape paka dance hata. Ah, ni. Bwana. Kumbe talate ngeno kutafuta kitambo. So, eh. So, mtoka ukaingia ukaingia Esage. Ah, nini eno matasiani? Yeah, oh, it's it's similar to the same go like Masai. Eno marasani? No, I went to Mogoti ya kwanza form 1. Oh yes, I've, yes. I've met some of your countries there. Mm. I know some of them are watching. Yeah, yeah. I went to Mugoti for my form one. Yeah. Alafu ndo nikakuja na matasia. Mugoti was uh, tafa. Ama what happened? Uh, I think I took I think mm. people work on any understanding. Huko. Unajua shule, ma, teacher if you're watching and you're a teacher, 
being loud ama kucheka na nguvu ama kuongea sana doesn't mean you're a bad student mm, yeah. So I think walikuwa wanaanga naongea sana coach. This one is bad. Yeah. So just kuna tu mwalimu wako ananipenda yani. Yeah. Hi. This one is just bad. You you are. Unajua ukicheka inakuwa ni hat. I mean acha kanga yule. Mimi niko kinichekesha aicheka yule. So unaweza hepa. Yeah, so you understand. Tafadhali kama hujaelewa itakuzumbua. So eh Oh yeah so So huko ikakuwa tafu. Asa primary no yeah. primary nilikuwa nikifunga shule na una auntie yako fulani anasema chemwa kama huko. So oh, okay. vina guka ngo after nimeingia boarding nilikuwa yeah. nafunga shule na nipata niko kwa huyo auntie Loret niko kwa huyo auntie Nairobi. Yes. Nikaanza yes. sasa assimilated into the city life. Umeanza kuona Nairobi. Yeah, kuna kuna ya. picha kadhaa tu tuma hapa ambazo mtaona akiwa Nairobi sasa ameanza kuona Nairobi. Ah. <laughs> Tuko na picha sasa si tunakata kuruja. Kama ile ya Savco itaweza sana. Ile ya jinsi ya Savco. Ni lumo kugona mapozi. Ile ya pozi. Ile ya pozi ya Michael Gordon. Oh, ah. Yeah. Oh. Tukipata tu picha mbili tatu hivi tu. Ya, tunarusha hapo ndani. To spice it up. Yeah, so we are the Nairobi kukua assimilated. Yeah. yeah. So So you come most of your aunties are here. Yeah, most at my mom was here. Mm. So I think after I enter form 1 actually don nilianza kuja Nairobi officially. Sasa kukaribishwa mjini. Mm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But I used to come nikifunga jobs in boarding school but officially after I think for one. Mm-hmm. Nilikuwa nikitoka Mogotoo tunapanda Molo line. Wakati karibu. Ujeni. Uh-huh. Yeah. So uh, So from there uh-huh. nikatoka hapo uh-huh. nikaenda Enomarasi ni Gas High School. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Nikasoma Enomarasi. Dangong na mtu apendi baridi by the. Yeah. So sijui hapo ni survive baadhi. Sipesi atisipendi uh-huh. niko na allergy ya baridi. Yeah. Saya ta baridi kinchapa vizuri ali sneeze you guys yeah. you know chapa ikitu hapa we are free so yeah. ani allergy si ati yeah. najitakia yeah i know yeah. Uh, i'm just telling the audience oh. ni audience na ongeleza naambia wazee baridi ndio noma so uko kongo for if for the four years yeah ile yeah. shule tulikuwa na watu wachache mimi nilitoka shule yenye tunapikiwa um, cabbage tunakula waseka tao eh eh shule shule nyolukwa ile mugoto for one yeah. so yeah men form 2 tuko shule nye mnapikiwa skuma imeva fiti na amisha <laughs> stale tulikuwa i think the whole school by your time tulikuwa ngas tu kama at most 400 Ah, ile adi pilikuwa na majo kicheko yako anajua kila mtu ukicheko yako anajua tuko wachache hadi anajua huyo ni stella <laughs> i know huyo ni stella ya yeah. yeah. so surprisingly mimi hakuna place yote kwa shule nishaifanya anything to do with drama yeah. is my poems ji ni nini yeah. i don't know malile tokia huko ukifanya shule but nilikuwa ngamchiki so to, kuna dem mwingine nitikiwa high school alikuwa anaitwa ngo university you should know kuna mbebe ile chimbo inaweza kuwa kali ya che Yeah. So ndo usome maskomu ende ufanye nini? Ufanye radio. Yeah. Yeah, you can do radio. Yeah. I didn't know. Kumbe tu alikuwa anaiona anga. Kumbe ilikuwa na kama. Mm. Lakini unajua sasa zingine ndio experience ya mtu ukio mtu hii, sasa zingine mtu u hide talent yake. Ju unaogopa hata utokee mbele ya watu utawaambia. Kwa taiza check. Lakini eventually itokea. We'll reach there. But so eno mata si ani tumepigana miaka 4. Mm, eh, Nairobi umeingia vizuri. Ah jiji. Ah sasa we mwenyewe ah yeah, unaipasua. Ah yeah. so yeah. after eno mata si ani ndio mimi nikaanguka hesabu na na migu zangu vizuri. Vizuri. So before nifanya 18 nikafanya kitu kinaitwa bridging. Eh. Yeah. Bridge eh nakumbuka guys hizo vitu za bridging. Ni kuna fanya wewe? Um Zitek. Ah. Eh ndio ndio uchukue course unapenda. Yeah. 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 So cause they will depend as quickly go here. Niko na kufanya mask on but pia pressure ya kununuliwa laptop. Yeah, kila mtu alikuwa na fanya IT. Kila mtu alikuwa na fanya laptop. Yeah. yeah. Bro yangu alikuwa na laptop alikuwa na yekele anga hapa anacheza FIFA. Ai, hey, waamini. Yes. <laughs> so you say let me let me go IT. Mm, I did Mali. IT. Say it your passion. <laughs> so <laughs> laptop. <laughs> So I I on Facebook yes I hope we get to meet by default yeah. we are sisters we happen to share a dad yeah <laughs> Mashallah bismillah rahman I think this is the purpose of this show 
So this... Niko, what do you mean? Yeah. Say, is your dad so and so? You Niko, I'm going to get a birth certificate. Yeah. Niko, I'm yes. Can I be? Yeah, so is mine. So we share the dad. Yeah. And I took a place plan, yeah. And do you know I felt so happy? Yeah. After I could... As he could scare you. Ulifungo, ulifungo picha nini? Yeah. You went to the profile. She's such a cute little girl. Yeah. She's 26, so I'm the elder sister. Yeah. I'm the final number. At Fanani as well, but it took to Mahali. Kuna, Kuna, same, Kuna, same lens, Mahali. So I can't imagine at 30. Yeah. So you can imagine I'm yet to know about more siblings. Oh, yes. In fact, it will be a show that will do. I'm waiting for her to come. To only come to Nezenda, Ocha, to Kandem Zai. Yeah. Now you're Shaneke Takoni, not a Tujua. Have you met that? No. But but you know. Maybe it's not now. No, it's not now. Yeah. Now. Do you see the memory? I get a moja. Yeah. So is it something you want to to do? Yeah, I'm old enough to make decisions. Yes. So when I start to go under, I will dem to any reaction. I get a tujua. I get it. Mumpiki se ma story muski akwadi. That would be some life. But someone told me, Sazingina Akiwa Maji and Asemanga, and you can Akidana engineer and I'm Senonga and Akonga TV. I think part two in the Tafanya, I Akifika Kenya, I think Arakuja December. We go to yeah, LK Marco to look for this man. Yeah. I turned to his side of the story. Yeah. Yeah. And, and you know, one of the things, guys, you've been saying is that the Rowan candidate should be open to other people's stories. So this is the, the beginning of it. This is the first one. So the next show, next week, will be bigger and will we'll feature some stories that we've already collected. What we name it, Tafuta Nini. And if you watch and you want to be, to be featured on this show, yeah, please link up up to Ambie. So that, I mean, the, the more the merrier, the more stories we get, the better. Because the essence of this show is keeping it raw and candid, opening it up. So the next, the next trip to Nenda Road Trip, near Tafuta. Yeah, see, but first, see, it's a yeah, No, the next show we are doing is story mm -hmm. of This guy has some stories here yeah, for days. So, um, I think I'll, I'll say I'm not going to look for Mzae for closure or anything. No. Because everything I am, me and my yes. big bro, it's courtesy of my mom. She has mm. been there holding it down. I think it's going to audition. I think it's going to be a good Tuesday, but don't wanna believe in me. So everything that I've become, I, I am near my mom. Yeah. But I just want to see this man. Yeah. Yeah. First, we see the sister. Mm. And then, twenty uko. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, that's a beautiful thing. So, guys, we'll do. We want to do her more story maybe next week. See, it maybe next week we are doing her more story, mm -hmm. and then from there we give you a chance to come and share your stories. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone has a story, and that story is what makes you beautiful. I'm a prof, I'm a prof, eh. So guys, thank you so much for listening to my story. That is what makes me beautiful and that is who I am. So next week we are doing Hamo's story. Kindly subscribe to this amazing channel. We are, we are we're going to bring you amazing content. And uh, have an amazing weekend. I'll see you again next Friday. Bye.